Hello, welcome to 9design 3D. Let's make this cute dinosaur. Add a cube to our scene. Ctrl 2 for add subdivision modifier. Ctrl A to apply. After Ctrl 1 add subdivision again. G to move. Tap to edit mode and check cage. Select bottom vertices, O to proportional edit and G to move as to scale. Give your mesh a bit egg look, but bottom will be flat. Numpad 3 for side look. To back part of it, select vertices and G to move a bit for white back shape. Select half of mesh vertices and X to delete. Tap to object mode and add mirror modifier. Don't forget to check clipping. Let's make feet. Select faces and delete them. Press 2, that top of your keyboard. Select your edges with Alt, right click. Go to loop tools and choose circle. If it's not work on your blender, go to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons, right loop tool and click checkbox, checkbox to activate. E to extrude in Y-axis, scale a bit and rotate. E to extrude again and F to fill. For smooth look, after that, press Ctrl B to bevel. Don't make too much, otherwise shape will be distorted. For arms, we make same process. Delete faces. Loop tool. Select circle. E to extrude. F to fill and bevel. Let's make dinosaurs bony plates. We will use same method that making foot and arms. Delete faces, loop tool and circle. E to extrude and scale. Ctrl B to bevel. Add another loop cut with Ctrl R for bottom part of bunny plate. You can rotate and scale for natural look. We made same process for other plates. Select tail end, faces and scale them in x-axis for wider look. It's time to add face parts. Add UV sphere for eyes, rotate 19 degrees in x-axis, scale and shade smooth. Numpad 3 for side view. 
Z to wireframe in edit mode, select half of it and delete vertices. F to fill backline edge circle. G to move and place to your dinosaur's face. Shift D to duplicate second eye. For mouth, add torus. Major radius for outer part size, minor radius for inner part. You can set your scale with decreasing these values. Don't forget to change major segments number. R, X, 19 degree, Z to wireframe and tap to edit mode, delete half of it. Select top edge lines, F to fill and bevel a bit. Place it your dinosaur's face. For cheeks, shift D to duplicate eyes and scale in z-axis. Let's make some gradient colors. Add material in shading tab. Add color ramp. Ctrl T for mapping node. If it's not work, go to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons and check the Node Wrangler. Choose colors with plus icon at third option. Set color to your all color ramp nodes. Important thing, add separate XYZ node. You see your gradient in different axes. In texture coordinate, plug your object to the mapping node. You can see the gradient in uh, top to bottom. For eyes, add black material and decrease roughness. For cheeks, add pinky color. And for mouth, you can set dark orangey color. Add your parts to the collection with M. Let's make dinosaurs toy as a dinosaur. Shift D to duplicate. Add new collection dino toy. Scale and move around and place it to your main character. Change the toy color, click new material icon and set new name. In color ramp, you can choose which color you want. Let's set up render scene. Add plane and scale. We will use either render. Check your ambience, bloom and screen space. Set your shadow, 2K resolution. Add area lights. In 
In shading tab, world section, increase background strength for more light look. Select plain edges, E to extrude in Z, four corners, bevel them, and add material. Render will be look like that. Thank you for watching.